Hello everyone, I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial. It's a really nice purple look using Coastal Scents, but you can use whatever brands you want. It's a gorgeous look. I think it looks really good on brown eyes, but it will look good on everyone. That is the look. I think it's awesome, so I hope you all enjoy it, and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, so we are going to apply some Coastal Scents eyeshadows from the 88 Metal Mania palette. And the color we are going to use all over the lid is this purple, like lavender purple color. And then in the crease we're going to use this like darker purple. And then in the inner corner we're going to use like a pearly white. So, get, you don't have to use Coastal Sands, you can use MAC or NYX. Anything you have, Maybelline, anything will work as long as you have a purple color. Now where did I put my brush? Right here. <laughs> now the MAC 2 242 brush is my favorite eyeshadow brush. It's my all time favorite. So you're going to apply that first color all over your lid and above the crease. So, let me adjust my camera. <laughs> So I just apply that everywhere. Hopefully you can see that. I think the lavender and purple colors really look good on dark eyes but they look good on everyone I think but I always get compliments when I wear like purples and stuff <laughs> Hopefully you can see this good. My windows are open so it's, I don't know if the lighting is better, but I don't know. <laughs> so we're going to blend this out with the 224 brush from MAC. I'm just going to apply more of that color just a little bit more. Okay. That should be good. And now we're going to apply that crease color. This is my favorite crease color. I mean, crease brush. This is by Pure Minerals. It looks like this. But you can use anything that looks sort of like this or you like to use to put color in your crease. So we're just going to get that brighter purple. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so I'm just going to apply it to our crease. See? not like extremely bright but you can tell that it adds something to your eyes so you're just gonna blend it out like that and I'm just going to add a little bit more. Okay. And blend, blend, blend. That should be about good. I'm actually just going to apply a highlight. Well, this is just a face powder, but it really brings down you have too much color on, it really just blends that, that color down. 
like that. <laughs> oh, you can see it. Okay, now what I'm going to do is add just a pearly white to the inner corners. Just like this area right here. This will brighten up your eyes and make it look really fresh. So, that's that will make your eyes look really awesome. Like that. And just blend it out. So there's not too much and it doesn't look too harsh. Like that. I'm just going to add a tiny bit more. Okay, that should be good. Now what I'm going to do is add my gel eyeliner to my waterline and my lash line. So I'll be right back with the lip look. Okay, I did my mascara and my eyeliner. So that's what it looks like. And I'm going to apply a lip color. This is the Maybelline Shine Sensational Lip Gloss in Glamorous Gava. It's this really pretty color. Well, you can see it. It's beautiful. I really love these lip glosses. I actually want more, th more of them. I only have two. But it just really is nice. They aren't sticky at all and they're very glossy. They look like okay, and that is our finished look.